Hello everybody, welcome to my channel Rereads. I'm Rhiannon and today I'm showing you a brief outline of, of what I would like to read during the Christmas season, the festive season and the winter period. Um, so these are the books I like to get through and I've got a mix from the library and a mix of my own. So I would like to read the Winter Wedding by Abby Clements. Um, I got this from the library. Um, I read the blurb and it sounds amazing. I like Christmas, I like winter, and I like some romance. The next book I've got is by Melissa Hill. It's called The Charm Bracelet. I have no idea what this is about because I haven't read it yet. I want to go in blind with these books. But um, again, I read the blurb. I think I might start with this one first. Like tonight, snuggle up after I made my Christmas cards. Because yes, I make Christmas cards. So I'm a very busy bee over the Christmas season. So normally I don't get time to read until like the week, till like Christmas time. So I'll definitely be reading this. And then the next book I want to get through is another Melissa, Melissa Hill book. And again, this is from the library. It's called um, A Gift to Remember. Um, I just love the cover for this. I think this is like a, let's borrow it from the library because I really like the paper cup the little paper people and the trees and the cover uh, it's so lovely and so nice and I can't yeah I can't wait to cozy up and read I just, <laughs> I just love Christmas and books and stuff like that the next book is not really a Christmassy themed book but it is a wintry book it's called the winter the winter ground it's a dandy gilver mystery by Katona Mc Fearson, is that it? Is it? I was intrigued by this because I love mystery as well. So um, it's set in a circus. I think it is also set in a circus as well. So the circus comes to town. There's a bit of a mystery. Um, I can't wait to read this. I will probably read it towards the end of December after Christmas. Next book I have got, this is from my own shelf, is uh, New York Christmas by Anne Perry. Um, I don't know very much about this, but um, yes, I'm... I don't know what to make, I don't know, um, it's nice and short as well, because I like short books, especially when you're busy and you just want a short, short book. The next book I've got, and I've been me I was meaning to read it last year, but I didn't get around to it, is The Adventure of the Christmas Pudding by Agatha Christie. Um, I can't wait, I, I haven't read an Agatha Christie book yet, so in the new year I would like to. So, um, I like to read, I might have a month dedicated to Agatha Christie, because I've got to get through some of them. I got a, I got a book gift. Yeah, I got gifted Agatha Christie set two Christmases ago, and I still haven't picked any of her books up. So I'm going to start with this one and see what I make of it. The next book, I will probably read a few stories from here, but um, I I liked most of the stories, and I tried to read all of them last year, but I didn't get very far because most this book is a very mixed bag for me. I liked some of the stories, and I didn't like some of the stories. And I just felt like I this year I might just pick and choose some of my favourites and see how I go. But it's um, My True Love Gave to Me 12 Winter Romances. So I'll, I will see how I go with this book. I do love the cover though. I like, love it. And I think the last book I am planning on reading is A Christmas Carol and Other Christmas Writings by Charles Dickens. I just love my copy so much. It's got snowflakes on it and everything. I may read Christmas Carol... Um, starting on Monday and see if I can get through that before Christmas Eve um, because I also like to read some books on my Kindle and I have The Night Before Christmas I like to read on Christmas Eve um, I don't really have any traditional book I don't really read books on Christmas Eve because I tend to get so busy with making trying to make a trifle and everything but yeah um, I'm excited to read all the books that I have mentioned um, also any of the books that I have shown could make good last minute Christmas gifts for anyone so yeah so i will um see you in my next video hopefully on friday fingers crossed on friday and i'm going to be doing a book tag because i haven't done one in a while and i would like to do more tags in the new year and i will also be posting before new year my 2017 goals so yes so yes i will see you in my next video Bye bye